Hey guys, this is Constantine again from Palo Alto, California, the very heart of Silicon Valley. And today I found a very cool article for you about self-driving cars industry called Hyundai Baked Motional to launch fully driverless cars in Las Vegas. What moves you? When people change the world, they call it a movement. Movement is power. It's opportunity. It's pushing forward, determined to create a better future. It's imagining the impossible, then making it real. It's what drives us. We are emotional, and we're making driverless vehicles a reality. So, Motional actually achieved several great things during last years. It's made first uh, pilot launch of Robotaxi in Singapore. It's also made first trip uh, from New York to San Francisco. And together with the Lyft, they accomplished over 100,000 rides in Las Vegas. Motional, the self-driving car operator baked by Hyundai and Aptiv, has received the green light to roll out a test fleet of fully driverless cars in Las Vegas. The state of Nevada has granted the company permission to operate its autonomous vehicles without a human safety driver behind the wheel. Currently, only a small handful of AV operators have actually deployed fully driverless vehicles, also known as level 4 autonomous vehicles, on public roads. So, great guys, they work towards self-driving robotaxi and this is a very great deal. And this is uh, one thing about robotaxi, why it's so important for many companies to get to this place. Because they believe it's gonna be next Google, because this robotaxi is a cash cow. So you operate fleet of robocars without humans and you charge people for this transportation. It's gonna be big, it's gonna be huge. And many, many startups and tech companies, tech giants, they go into the same, in my opinion, to the same point, this robotaxi. Of course, they approach it by different ways. One company develop technology, one company develop, develop vehicles, one company develop like a market strategy, one company develop safety features, one company can develop, you know, uh, distant telecommunication to operate cars if they fail. So many, many solutions to achieve this great robotaxi vision. One more thing I want to add, why many companies don't launch robotaxi right away, because technology is almost there, because they are very cautious about this, because after first incidents, they have to reconsider their strategy and also think about how to operate even more safely than they do now. Because I think uh, after Uber tragic uh, accident, a lot of companies evaluate their safety strategy and they invest heavily in that. They really want to be careful on the roads. And that is good for us. We're going to be safer because computers don't drink alcohol. They drive very carefully and I expect it will bring us a lot of joy during ride in those autonomous cars. If you like it, please like and subscribe. You will get more content from me. Thank you. Bye.